Hey guys, this is Unteddy here, and I'm back again with this fight, and I think I'm actually going to read the stuff this time instead of speeding through it. On this episode of Let's Play Soul Silver Randomized Winners Like Challenge, we're going to head on our way to Victory Road. I completely forgot about Victory Road. I was like, yeah, we're going to get to the Pokemon League in a couple episodes. I was like, no, this game probably has one of those. Well, it's got to have the only not annoying Victory Roads were Black and White and... I think Black and White, Black and White 2, and then X and Y really wasn't that bad. But before that, they all suck. And maybe I'll get around to reading it someday. Since you've come this far, you must be good. I'm going to give you this battle everything I got. I think I missed an adverb or an adjective or a article in there. That's the A word I was looking for. Now, do you have a... No, you just have a Pikachu. I guess I never would have known with the sp spinning Pokeball. So, Pikachu, I can I can deal. What's the, well, the worst he's going to do to us is do a double team annoying strategy. If I just keep on hitting Iron Head, it doesn't matter. And actually, I just need to hit two... Iron heads. That would be lovely. Beautiful. Oh, okay, I really don't care about the static now that I'm good. I can always go to that house right over there and heal. And getting that shell bell back. Beautiful. And blast to it. Okay, we definitely don't want AA run in for this one. And uh, let's see how you fight another starter, bro. Oh, okay, just about the same level. That's a really cool looking sprite. Like, the blue is just a really cool tone. It's a shame you gotta die in a one hit KO. Oh, are you. You gotta, you gotta hit those, Basil. You gotta hit those. Even though you're gonna get like zero damage done. Okay, just a decent amount. You gotta hit those? Thank you, Basil. Now, if you don't want to KO, I'm not super mad at you because it's, it's a, it's a decently leveled Pokemon. I wouldn't be surprised. Even though you have like that 300 base damage plus stab. I wonder if stab gets factored. The stab get factored before, because then if it's before, it's 15 extra damage. If it's after the super effective, that's 30 extra damage. Which I mean, that's a minuscule amount at this point if I'm already doing that much. But still, and mother, I don't need more of your items, even though they're very helpful. And I have to remember to go back to Kurt and give him all these apricorns, so I can get at least some extra Pokeballs in case I run into another catching situation, because. What other legendaries are there? Oh, well, there's the three birds, there's Mewtwo, there is the other legendary, which I think this is the only game, and one of the, uh, not Frida Friday, that's the only one whose name I remember. One of the, like, sisters who come up each day is up in a house up there, and I don't know which day it is. I can always check, maybe she is Frida Friday. Oh, no, it is Friday, so it wouldn't be Frida Friday, because I'm pretty sure I know where Frida Friday is. And I want to go heal AA Ron, because he's low-leveled, and he needs all this XP he can get. And AA Ron's back in the fight with even more cool trainers than you could count. By experiencing tough battles, you gain power. That's it, I mean, he's right. I always have to make some snide remark, and they're not cool trainers. I keep on calling them cool trainers, but they're ace trainers, and why do you have so many Pokemon? Also, why do you have to have a grass Pokemon? That's no fun. So I would want to switch into Ezio. I think Ezio is a good switch here. Razor Leaf, that won't do that much, hopefully. Okay, that's a decent amount. I gotta be careful. Icy Wind is going to do, I think, enough to at least two-shot. I don't think he'll get a one-hit KO unless we get a lucky critical. I really need Ice Punch. I wish Heart Scales were easier to get. It's just such a pain. Toxic, that's annoying, but it won't affect us because we'll just hit you next turn. We're just going to have to walk back and heal Ezio back up after this. But if we're just going to be getting one person, running back even further, getting one more person, we'll make it the Victory Road someday. We're going to do that through the entirety of Victory Road. We'll just be running through, like, three strength puzzles every time. Be like, oh, okay, we got to heal. That's what sucks about the Nuzlocke Randomizer Challenge. Well, just maybe the Nuzlocke part. You just got to... You gotta be very careful of your Pokemon if you really like them, which I, I love, I like my team right now. Also, they, uh, there's another picture dude, the guy who I thought was one of those dad trainers who I can't, super Poke fan or Poke fan, who I, I just randomly passed because I didn't want to fight him on screen, was actually a pho photographer, and I want to, after this, when we go back, oh no, there's no PC, I can't check the pictures, I was like, oh, I'll go back where I heal, I can check, no, you can't, there's gotta be a PC before we go into the Victory Road, and it says it has all the pictures on there, so I want I just want to check that out and, like, chronicle how our team has evolved. Even though there's not that many places to take pictures, I really did not expect anything else besides Arsenius getting a one-shot on that. Also, if you've noticed, I've given Rooster the experience share, because Rooster needs to be very far ahead of levels with not getting that evolution to be useful for our team. 
and I think it was the best option because A.A. Ron can still fight himself and get some levels, but everyone else is sort of, eh? And why did I think he had, like, six Pokemon? Maybe I'm just seeing things. Also, something I didn't mention, and probably someone will leave a comment about in the last episode, which will be coming out. I have no damn idea. But, uh, the fisherman who finally had the quillfish was named Scott, and I made no mention of it. That's what you get for playing with Tab. Also, good old Gavin spelled very weirdly that we're fighting here. Like, Gavin. And Rooster wants their own safeguard. We already... Oh, no, we don't have a guy with safeguard on our team, but I don't think... She is a very utility person for us now. I know Tuggy Kiss is a very good physical... No, it's a special attacker. We're not going to do this again, Scott. But at this point, Rooster is pretty much a utility for, with the Wish, the Yawn, the uh, Shadow Ball with the Drop, and for Fly for out-of-battle utility. God, life is even tougher. Life sucks and then you die. My math teacher would always say that in grade school, and I was just like... Uh, I, I didn't comprehend the whole life and death thing at that point, so I was just like, we, we all hate you. She's a nice lady, she was just sort of, <laughs> like I say about my siblings sometimes, they're a nice person, but also they're a bitch. Also, I got really quiet on that because I don't know if she's home or not, and I don't want to hear, bum, 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 what the hell you say about me? Except she doesn't slap me in the face. I slap her in the face because you got to keep a woman in a place. By slapping her in the face, I can't rhyme anything with place because I got to get out of this place. I don't care about talking to you. You're tough. I haven't battled seriously in a long time. Could I get your phone number? I'm going to battle after hear my Pokemon. Why am I talking like this? I'm not even rhyming. I'm just like, I'm the worst rapper ever. I'm just like, yo, I'm talking in rhyme, but I'm not even rhyming. I just rhyme rhyme with rhyme. You can't even stop me. Rhyme. Word. Best white rapper NA. Oh god, I need to get home. I think I'll be perfectly fine with that to you. Oh yeah, he'll be good. I can I can take the long walk. Okay, we're getting back out there. And there's another person right here. Is this really going to go what I said it would be? Also, what is up with the weird path? Is this where Free to Friday is? Free to Friday, Free to Friday, Free to Friday. And what do you got to say, Mr. Ace Trainer? See, I'm finally, I'm getting it together. I'm getting, it only took like 30 plus episodes, probably 40 at this point, but I'm getting myself together. I'm making my final preparations for the Pokemon League. Well, you kind of got that whole victory road. I'm always snarky every time I read one of those. If it's, it's either sarcasm or snarkiness, where as soon as I read those, but I mean, dude, you kind of got to get it ready for victory road first. It's kind of going to be a bigger deal than getting past the Elite Four. Elite Four scrubs. And uh, I think Rooster can come in. He's a little he's a little bit over leveled. That's what he's here for. Spore paralyzes, doesn't it? And you're a pain in Oh no, it sleeps. Uh I can break it. Sword stance. Uh oh. Uh one more fly chance. Is he gonna sword Oh, this is not good. Uh, the hell do we do here, Maggie? Unless he's a fighting type move, slash that is a high critical radio rate, <laughs> high critical radio. Uh, okay, she can't do that much, so we can just get her in a bad situation. We can't really hurt her; she can't really hurt us. So we're gonna do that, and now she is putting us to sleep again. Wonderful. Parasect is just one of those really weird Pokemon that you never see. And I can imagine, especially by this moveset that it has here, it's one of those Pokemon that, like, people put the video videos up for on YouTube where they, like, sweep an entire team. Because it's got, like, such a weird moveset, so I guess it would spore someone and then, like, Sword Stance, even though I don't know if it actually has a high physical attack. And the reason I healed there, even though it looks like I'm not in danger at all, that high critical ratio could come out and screw me over. And even with the not very effective, and I think he's still in good range. Yeah, there we go. Perfect. That, for a Pokemon of that stature, that should not have taken us that far. And, oh god, I forgot about his low. Okay, I gotta remember, when I'm training, I'm a little bit less careful with what I'm doing. But now I gotta be a bit more careful, because things like that can happen. It got, well, that was way too close to the call. I do not want to be in a situation like that again, but as this Let's Play goes, I probably will in like two to three episodes time, and Ezio Basil, Ezio Basil, let's go with Ezio, because he's got that Psychic Duo type, and the Night Slash should, especially if he gets critical, 
not enough to kill him. Screech, you're going to lower... I want to say it's attack, but I, I'm thinking defense too, yeah. Partially solid, so good for us, and that's a KO. And so finally getting level 37, like something special happens to level 37, but it does not. Hey, it's Jake from State Farm. I blew it! You blew it, Jake. You blew it, Jake. You're losing your job at State Farm. And take a wild guess. W what am I going to do after this battle? A? I'm going to go here. I can't think of anything. I was trying to do the, the SpongeBob reference where it's like the... What's that episode called? Training... Training video? Where he's at the register and he's ordered something? What is he going to order? A. A sandwich? B. An expensive haircut? C. Shampoo? Or D. A patty. Or I think I did A. What? Never mind. I'm not the best at references. As you can probably see. I'm not the best at video commentary. As you can see. Somehow 600 and some people have been confused into clicking. They thought this was actually uh, Chugga Conroy's channel. Chugga Papa. They thought this was Chugga Conroy's channel. They, they did a little misclick somewhere. And it all kind of went downhill from there. And then they were like, oh, this guy's in my box. Whatever, unsubscribe. But they didn't click the unsubscribe button. So the views don't come. But they think, I'm even confusing myself. I don't know what the hell I'm talking about. I've run out of things to talk about. Thankfully, I have this list right here. I lost to a redheaded trainer. He was really strong, but he was redheaded, so he must be bad. It was Effie had absolutely had to win at any cost. I felt sorry for his Pokemon. Pff, I feel sorry for him. I do it every time. I gotta stop with the snark. I gotta be like, uh, nice, sympathetic, be like, oh, yeah, I feel bad for his Pokemon, too. Okay, the Rapidash is not a wild Pokemon in this area. Actually, I think it still is, but I just remember there being a Rapidash or someone in the Ponita family up here. And I'm going to bring in Arsenius because that's our best move here. I really wish Arsenius actually had, uh, what's it called? Fat body? Thick fat, that's what I'm thinking of. That reduces the power of fire type moves. That would stop the hole in our team of being really weak to fire types it would make it a lot better because that's like our team's biggest advantage as you saw from that houndoom fight that if a fire type comes up and am i thinking let's see is there a five t fire type elite four i believe there's not so we're in a good circumstance with that but if there was we would be we're, it's just it's not a good type for our team let me, I want to check something real quick, how weak we are the fire types, and, uh, okay, Flaffy, switch. Uh, see, with electric types, we don't have a direct counter, but we have Basil, who, not very effective, A.A. Ron, not very effective, Maggie, damage is not very effective towards it, but it also will take the not very effective damage, so we can at least n negate, is that the word? Yeah, we can at least negate the damage that electric types would do. See? Not a problem at all, but fire types, as I should have done while that little list was up there, you're very good at battling. We should battle again sometime. By challenging a tough trainer like you, I can get better too. So, yes, I would like your phone number because there's no reason not to take the phone numbers in this game. I don't think your PDA can get filled up. It would be really dumb if it could get filled up and they didn't add enough spots. Mother, I see you there talking about the PDA. I was like, oh, I can tell you all these tips about the PDA. But nope, let's see. Weak to fire, 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 and really nothing to combat against fire. That's our big hole in our team. Let's see if I can find anything else. Flying types, we can take care of it. Uh, electric types, uh, rock types, take care of it. Uh, dragon, take care of it. Uh, psychic, take care of it. Uh, nothing off the top of my head, unless I'm missing something here. I think fire and Fighting? Fighting. Fighting weak, weak, weak. Not weak, weak. Yeah, fighting and fire. So if they have it in Burn Ape somehow, we are screwed. And let's see, free to Friday is over here. Is this where they get TM? This has got to be where Earthquake is, because Earthquake's always where I say it is. And another Max Elixir when I think I'm getting a good item. Maybe someday. And I could have swear there's a house over here, but it looks like I am incorrect. Let's just head up here. Heal up our Pokemon, not by going backwards, but by going forward. Hopefully there's a PC in here so we can check out the pictures too. Let's just read the sign for the hell of it. Route 26, Pokemon League Reception Gate. Oh yeah, this is the cool like split off path where you got Metal Silver on the left and you got Ganto on the right. Only trainers who have proven themselves my pass. Oh, the eight badges of Johto. Please, right on through. And cool, cool. 
I, I wonder if there's any way, well, hmm. Yeah, there's no way you could get there without eight badges. I don't know why that check has to be there and you're gonna say Mount Silver, right? Scary Strong Pokemon. Yep, that's where our final battle will be hopefully taking place and no healing place, really? Da -da -da. Oh, and I, I did get it, but my headphones weren't turned up well enough that I could hear it. There's really no healing place. You have to walk all the way back there. Scumbag Nintendo. Alright, I'll be right back. I gotta walk back.